Page 66, Unit 8, New Experiences. Let's talk. A. Listen and say. Guess what? What? I'm going to go to France this summer. That's exciting. Have you been there before? No, it's my first time. I've been there twice. My uncle lives there. I visited him last summer. Wow, you're lucky. I don't know anyone there. You'll love France. There's only one problem. I don't speak French. Page 66. Language focus. Have you been there before? No, it's my first time. Yes, I've been there twice. B. Bin. Page 67. B. Practice the words. Number 1. Egypt. Number 2. China. Number 3. Hawaii. Number 4. Nepal. Number 5. The Grand Canyon. Number 6. Mount Everest. Number 7. France. Number 8. The Great Barrier Reef. Page 67. B. Ask and answer. Have you ever been to Egypt? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Number 1. Have you ever been to Egypt? Yes, I have. Number 2. Have you ever been to China? No, I haven't. Number 3. Have you ever been to Hawaii? Yes, I have. Number 4. Have you ever been to Nepal? No, I haven't. Number 5. Have you ever been to the Grand Canyon? Yes, I have. Number 6. Have you ever been to Mount Everest? No, I haven't. Number 7. Have you ever been to France? Yes, I have. Number 8. Have you ever been to the Great Barrier Reef? No, I haven't. Page 67. C. Listen and chant. Have you ever? Have you ever climbed Mount Everest? Yes, I have. I loved it. You will too. Have you ever been to China? Yes, I have. I loved it. You will too. Have you ever been to Egypt? No, I haven't. Have you ever been to Hawaii? No, I haven't. I've been there and everywhere. I loved it. You will too. Page 68. Let's learn. A. Learn the words. Number 1. Fried noodles. Number 2. Potato salad. Number 3. Sushi. Number 4. Ravioli. Number 5. Crepes. Number 6. Kimchi. Number 7. Tofu. Number 8. Tacos. Page 68. B. Ask and answer. Kate and Andy are talking about foods they have eaten. They want to taste new foods. Have you ever eaten sushi? Yes, I have. 
No, I haven't. Eat. Eaten. Number one. Have you ever eaten sushi? Yes, I have. Number two. Have you ever eaten kimchi? No, I haven't. Number three. Have you ever eaten tofu? Yes, I have. Number four. Have you ever eaten tacos? Yes, I have. Number five. Have you ever eaten potato salad? No, I haven't. Number six. Have you ever eaten fried noodles? Yes, I have. Page 69. C. Make sentences. I've eaten crepes. I've never eaten kimchi. I have. I've. Number one. I've eaten crepes. Number two. I've never eaten kimchi. Number three. I've eaten tacos. Number four. I've never eaten ravioli. Number five. I've eaten sushi. Number six. I've never eaten fried noodles. Page 69. D. Listen, point, and chant. Have you ever eaten sushi? Have you ever eaten sushi? No, I haven't. But I'll try it tonight. All right. Have you ever eaten tacos? No, I haven't. But I'll try them tonight. All right. Have you ever eaten tofu? Yes, I have. Have you ever eaten crepes? Yes, I have, but I've never eaten sushi. And I've never eaten tacos. I'll try them tonight. All right. Page 70. Let's learn more. A. Learn the words. Number 1. A crocodile. Number 2. An ostrich. Number 3. A panda. Number 4. A penguin. Number 5. A llama. Number six. A kangaroo. Number seven. A koala. Number eight. A hippopotamus. Page 70. B. Ask and answer. Scott and Jenny are talking about animals they have seen. Scott has seen a crocodile and a penguin. Jenny has seen a panda, an ostrich, and a kangaroo. Have you ever seen a crocodile? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. See. Seen. Number one. Have you ever seen a crocodile? Yes, I have. Have you ever seen a crocodile? No, I haven't. Number two. Have you ever seen a panda? Yes, I have. Have you ever seen a panda? No, I haven't. Number three. Have you ever seen an ostrich? Yes, I have. Have you ever seen an ostrich? No, I haven't. Number four. Have you ever seen a kangaroo? No, I haven't. Have you ever seen a kangaroo? 
Yes, I have. Number five. Have you ever seen a penguin? No, I haven't. Have you ever seen a penguin? Yes, I have. Page 71. C. Play a game. Ask and answer. Has she ever seen a crocodile? Yes, she has. No, she hasn't. Seen. Been. Eaten. Page 71. D. What about you? I've been to Hawaii. I've never been to Hawaii. Page 72. Let's read. A. Listen and read along. Then read again. The Dream Catcher. Do you ever have bad dreams at night? Native Americans believe that a dream catcher can catch your unhappy dreams. Then you will only have happy dreams. Have you ever seen a dream catcher? It looks like a spider's web. You can make a dream catcher. Here is how to do it. 1. Cut out the center of a paper plate. Around the plate, make holes about one centimeter apart. 2. Put yarn into one hole. Then weave the yarn from hole to hole, up and over, around the plate. 3. Now, weave across the plate. A few pieces of yarn can hang down. Put beads on the yarn. 4. Finally, tie feathers to the yarn. Hang your dream catcher on the wall. Sweet dreams! Page 72. B. Choose the correct answer. Number 1. What does a dream catcher look like? Number 2. What does a dream catcher do? Page 73. E. Listen and write. Do you hear ch or t? Number one. Put. Number two. Catch. Number three. Cat. Number four. Hopscotch. Page 75. C. Let's read about the Grand Canyon. John and Lisa's travel blog. We're in the USA! Hello from the Grand Canyon, USA. This morning, we went rafting on the Colorado River. The river goes through the Grand Canyon. We went through a lot of rapids. They were very rough. We've never gone rafting before. It was exciting. In the afternoon, we camped near the river. For dinner, the guides cooked steaks over a campfire. The steaks smelled and tasted delicious. Tonight, we're going to sleep outside. We can hear the river. It sounds wonderful. We can also see a lot of stars. We've never seen so many stars.